Hello everyone, welcome to Halo Moon Tarot. This is your weekly love reading for Pisces. Hope you're all well. Thank you so much for dropping in to listen. I do really appreciate it. Let's see if we can get some clarity here for you regarding your love life. Anything else that may show up? Pisces. What is the overall energy surrounding Pisces regarding their love life? The overall energy surrounding Pisces. What do they need to know? What does Pisces need to know? All right, Pisces. There we go. Blessings. Oh, nice. We have that bird. You may get a message. It may be a blessing. I see the canary. It's beautiful. Yeah, beautiful blessings could be coming your way. Lovely. Yeah, I think there's stillness right now, though. Some of you are, are hoping for some kind of blessing. Some kind of, maybe it may feel a little bit like you're needing a miracle, but you see all this beauty. I see there's some kind of a message. Someone's turning their back here, not moving, just sort of very still. Everything's been very, is being very quiet. It could be a blessing, actually. <laughs> Nothing's moving, Pisces. Yeah, this card here hit my pinky, and that's usually a sign. Yeah, wisdom. So I feel somebody here is using their head over their heart, being wise, all right, trying to uh, learn something, using that intuition. We have some very deep, let's see, you can see there's this, it's like a mermaid floating down in the water, deep into the depths, all right. Very wise energy, Pisces. This is you going deep within, using your intuition, that inner wisdom, just staying still, not moving, okay? That could be a blessing, okay? So very interesting. We'll see. You may be waiting for a blessing, waiting for news from this canary energy with the blessings. Beautiful. I love that card. It's very sweet, right? Sweet messages. Sweet songs from the canary. All right, yeah, so we have a seed here. We have the Ace of Stones. We have a challenge, Two of Stones. So I feel there's a decision being made about planting the seed, giving somebody an offer. They may be coming towards you. You may not be moving. You're sort of just waiting, trusting your intuition that somebody is going to make a decision. Something's out of balance. This has been one of those stop, go, on and off situations. Uh, there, there's a need for balance, I feel, here, and a very solid decision needs to be made, a very solid, reliable decision to make this Wheel of Fortune move. It's going to take some kind of a blessing. <laughs> wow. Pisces. Yes, we have the sun. We have healing. We have frustration. We have the eight of stones. The moon. Wow. They came out so clean, I had to take them. There we go. And we have creativity. Yes, very interesting energy here. So I feel what's going on is we have this new beginning. It's right here. Someone needs to express themselves. Something was exposed. I feel somebody made themselves perfectly clear to do with some kind of manipulation. Uh, somebody was be became very frustrated. So I feel there's, there's definitely a... I feel like it's a blessing that everything's just kind of stopped. There's a need. It's right in the middle. There's a need for things to heal with the Seven of Stones. Seven of Pentacles energy. Patience is required here. This is all about divine timing. All good things take time. So I feel it's a blessing that things are just kind of still. It may be a blessing in disguise, but it's still a blessing. Things will start to move. There's a decision, a challenging decision. It has to do with somebody being reliable, planting the seed, right? This is the foundation of life is the seeds. And what do seeds need? They need water. They need sun. So we have this new beginning uh, somebody's frustrated, turned their back, they're not moving. Somebody has said something very clear to some another person. They're not investing in anybody or anything. That there is manipulation and mind games. So we have the eight of stones. Yeah, this person doesn't want to work on this anymore. This could be you, could be your person. Uh, there may be some kind of miscommunication. There are secrets, mystery, confusion, and possibly fears. Because I see this. Somebody's afraid 
to cooperate, to compromise. Someone is afraid. There's someone's, you know, something has been created here using creativity, but there's fear. Um, there's delusions and confusion. And I feel one of you does not want to put the work into this. Somebody doesn't want to put the work in. They don't, uh, the other person's walking away. It's you or them. You're going to have to decide for yourself, cutting somebody out, uh, refusing to move forward, uh, to put any more work into it when there's something hidden. There's too much fear here because there's this creativity. Somebody is trying to come up with creative ways to get what they want, to get the other person to compromise, and it's not going to work, okay? So I feel like you're going deep within here. You're digging very deep using your intuition here looking for answers you have all the answers you need your intuition will be telling you do not invest in anybody who um, plays mind games and manipulates it's very frustrating and i feel someone's very frustrated with this situation it's just like it's like enough already okay something was someone made themselves perfectly clear that you know there's this ending because there was a challenge Something wasn't solid, I feel. Something was exposed here about this new beginning, some kind of offer that was supposed to be a blessing. It was supposed to make things move forward, but then something was exposed where somebody, you know, there was this lack of healing. Somebody wasn't invested in the right way. They weren't exposing their feelings and emotions, keeping them hidden, or just keeping secrets, being playing mind games. So we have the Ace of Stones. Why is this here for Pisces? Why is this here? Yeah, so yeah, so there is a lot of work that needs to be done. Somebody wants to work things out, okay? But it's just one seed, right? The seed isn't being nurtured. It needs to be something just didn't work out here. There's too many challenges. I feel one of you does not want to deal with this anymore. It's just becoming too much. Yeah, it's just looking back, it's just too much work. We have some fire energy here, maybe Leo. Cancer and Pisces, your person may have cancer in their chart. I feel as though with the two of stones, it's just such a challenge. Somebody feels they don't want to put any more work in. They're just feeling too beat up by this. It's been this on and off, on and off, and wanting to put this behind and move towards something more successful. But there is a need for something to be let go, all right? This is a need to, somebody's not surrendering, all right? because there's manipulation. Someone's using that creative energy to try to get somebody to compromise, okay? But there's secrets, delusion, and there's too much fear because of mind games. So there's this energy of taking, someone's taking everything they learned and moving away, putting an end to this. And it may be a blessing in disguise, okay? Uh, it would take, I'm gonna tell you, it's gonna take a miracle. Something was definitely exposed, and it would take a miracle to get this going. There's a need for this deep healing. There is a new beginning. It's very possible. But somebody didn't put the work in. Somebody didn't do things in the right way. We have the wheel. Why is the wheel here? Oh, too many cards. The wheel. There we go. Thank you. Yeah, see? Somebody couldn't see a way forward. I feel as somebody was trying to make peace, trying to come forward with something that they learned. And it didn't happen because there was somebody, they either have their heart chakra blocked or someone doesn't see a way forward. There was this indecision and everything just kind of stopped. Everything's very stuck and stopped. It may be a blessing, like I said, but somebody was hoping for this blessing. They were looking back, hoping to make peace, that things would move forward calmly and peacefully, but it didn't because of some kind of a manipulation. So tell me about the sun of life. Why is the sun of life here? Why is the sun of life here? Why is the sun of life? Why is the sun of life here? There we go. Finger. Ah, uh, yeah. Scorpio energy. So something has, something needs to end for this to transform. Okay. So there's this ending, but now there's this transformation energy, this healing. Very much a healing. It's going to take some patience. It's going to take time. Maybe the time wasn't right. Somebody came in too soon, came in the wrong way. It didn't produce healing, I'll tell you, it, because somebody said, no way. No way, right? Nope, this, I'm not, uh, I'm putting an end to this. I don't see uh, any change here. I think somebody came in too soon before 
somebody's heart's blocked. Somebody definitely has blocked feelings, that heart chakra you see here. And they really do need to open up and express themselves. And somebody would not express themselves. So it ended. There's a lack of healing. And that's what it is. It's all about timing and divine timing. Uh, I feel it's a blessing, possibly, that this happened because somebody does need to go through some kind of transformation. They need to open up their heart chakra all the way and be able to express themselves fully. Seven of Stones. Why is this healing here with the Seven of Stones? Oops, there we go. We're going to take that one and this one. Yeah, so somebody, yeah, see, there we go. What we have is, yeah, somebody came in. They weren't ready. So there was a rejection. Somebody says, nope, this isn't good enough. Uh, I don't see this healing. I don't see this transforming. I don't see any change in you. So someone came in too soon before they were ready to express themselves, to plant the seed. They didn't put enough work in. They didn't take care of the seed. They planted it, but they didn't nurture it. They didn't give it water because they're not expressing their feelings. It's hidden. It's buried. Somebody has some deep fears, deep, deep seated uh, emotional issues that they need to do some inner work. Somebody needs to do some inner work to transform this. So, wow. Somebody, whatever it is that happened, whether it's you or this person, I see Scorpio, I see Leo, uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, energy, very strong here. So, and I do see some earth as well. I feel like, yeah, someone's like, no, nope, I don't feel safe and secure with this. I don't feel like this is going anywhere. I don't feel like this is the right time. Uh, somebody definitely um, isn't completely invested in expressing themselves. Someone's patience is wearing out here. They've had enough. They're frustrated because there's some kind of manipulation, mind games. Someone's playing mind games, playing games instead of expressing themselves. There we go. Yeah, right? To have this new beginning. Someone made themselves perfectly clear. They're not dealing with mind games, okay? Manipulation of any kind, period. And they've turned to their back and everything just stopped right there. Wow. Eight of stones. Yeah, see, there's that. Three of Stones, creativity. So somebody's trying to create something. They're working on something. Okay, this is cooperation, compromise. Somebody doesn't see this working. They don't want to compromise themselves. They don't see this person as a team player. They don't see it working, right? And the sad thing is, it's here. There is compatibility between two people, but somebody is not putting the work in. They don't want to put the effort in to plant the seed, to nurture it, to care for it. Yeah, somebody is definitely working on themselves, going within. Uh, deep, very deep emotional issue, but there's fear here, and this is why this... We have this swan, this stillness. This is like the Queen of Swords, right? Turning their back, holding themselves in high regard. Yes, thanks, but no thanks. <laughs> and they express themselves very clearly. They wanted this new beginning. You both want this new beginning, but somebody is frustrated because the other person won't express their feelings. They won't transform. They won't change. There's a need. Somebody's going through an awakening. They need to open up. They came in too soon. Somebody wasn't healed and they didn't. They came in too soon. We have the moon. Why is the moon here? Why is the moon here? Something needs to be illuminated. Ah, oh, there you are, Pisces. Ah, oh, you're digging deep. This, this could be you. You're digging deep, deep into your emotions, okay? Looking for answers to do with what you're afraid of. You could be this. You can take this however it resonates, okay? This could be you having deep-rooted fears. You don't want to compromise yourself. This person's trying to use um, this some wisdom. Uh, they're trying to use this manipulation, possibly. They've learned something. They're coming towards you with something they learned, maybe how to manipulate, because they don't want to express themselves. They want they want this to transform, but they're not. Somebody's not feeling safe and secure. Like this seed is going to grow into the ten of pentacles. So if there'll ever be a commitment, someone's not believing it. There's a lot of this is very emotionally draining. So there's it's a good. It's actually a blessing that things have stopped. I really feel that here because someone needs to dig deep into their emotions or feelings. They need to use that inner wisdom. 
uh, to cooperate, compromise, but somebody is not compromising themselves. They're not going to let somebody manipulate them into co cooperating when they're not going to get what they want, when they feel they're not, things aren't being expressed, exposed, and illuminated. Wow, three of stones. Got some wise people here. You both could have Pisces in your chart, actually. Yeah, see, we've got this three of cups. Somebody is not cooperating, not compromising. And I feel what's being exposed is somebody is sharing those cups out there with other people. They're not... There may be gossip, too many people involved. Someone wants to be happy. They're not expressing themselves. Somebody wants to keep... Uh, a relationship secret, keep it hidden. They don't want to go out in public. They're not cooperating. They don't They don't want to compromise their other people, their other friends. Oh, yeah. So I would be a little bit cautious here with this person. All right. So tell me about blessings. So it may be a blessing in disguise. You may have actually dodged a bullet with this person. They actually came in too soon. Because I feel if this person came in and expressed their emotions and this transformed... I have a feeling what would be exposed even further down the road is more manipulation because somebody is trying to manipulate somebody. They don't want to cooperate. Uh, they don't want to compromise their other, the other people they reach out to, they talk to. They don't want uh, gossip. They don't want people to know. They want to keep you secret. Okay, somebody is keeping a lot of really deep secrets here that they don't want... Um, brought out into the open they don't want to compromise it okay who and i usually see the three because it's creativity somebody is creating uh has created a situation here and i i feel like you've dodged a bullet this person came in too soon i think they need to go within very deeply this person needs to some very deep transformation their heart chakra or i and i also feel this person does not want to change they're fighting this every step of the way. You want to be happy. You want somebody, look at that. It's not working. Somebody didn't put the work in. Somebody is blocked. Something has just come to a standstill because someone isn't expressing themselves. Someone's not counting their blessings, okay? Uh, and yeah, wow. It's a blessing in disguise. Let me tell you, I feel like, some of you are going to use your intuition here. You're going to dig deep, look for answers. Because you have this fear and you feel that there's secrets, this person's trying to keep you secret or they're keeping secrets. Maybe you've got some secrets, some, you know, things that you're hiding to do with this person. You don't want to express them uh, because you feel they have secrets. You know, other people they reach out to, people in their community. Uh, there may be gossip something that somebody heard they're trying to manipulate a situation i'd be very careful wow stillness why is stillness here why is stillness here yeah so i feel yeah you're both still yeah neither one of you are moving uh you're both kind of just feeling very stuck Somebody is not expressing their feelings and the emotions are not. Some truth has been exposed here, I feel, or it's about to be. Some kind of manipulation. It became very clear somebody is being dishonest. They're trying to have a new beginning, but they're not being honest. There's a lack of trust, right, that there's this new beginning. Someone knows this is never going to be solid, reliable, that they can trust this person and feel comfortable with them. They don't feel safe. It's like, I can't accept this. It doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel uh, like it's ever going to go anywhere. So I feel somebody here is definitely more emotionally invested than the other. And I feel that this person is not moving right now. But I feel eventually that Queen of Swords energy will, you know, she generally turns back and just cuts things out and moves on towards somebody who will cooperate and compromise and put the effort and put the work in. So, wow really heavy stuff guys tell me about wisdom yeah there we go so yeah see there's someone needs to tame the beast here oh i see that there is i i feel there we have a leo energy definitely strong leo but it doesn't have to be it's just that that clarity that sun that happiness feel like 
someone is hiding something, they have some very deep, dark secret, someone needs to go within, find that strength, right, that inner strength, tame the beast, someone needs to tame their passions, somebody's definitely uh, keeping some secrets, they're trying not to compromise, they're using creative, manipulative ways to keep a secret, to hide their feelings, or to, they're using the fact that they may be expressing themselves, that they're hiding their feelings, because they have some kind of fears, right? It's a big manipulation, but really what they're trying to hide is the fact they have other people. They're afraid there's going to be gossip. They want to keep they want to keep this relationship a secret. They don't want anyone to know because they have all these other people who give them that emotional attention, offering one cup here and there. So yeah, someone's hiding something. There's this passionate new beginning. Someone's going very deep within looking at this, knowing they need to Someone doesn't feel confident that someone will be, they can feel safe with them in a, in a physical encounter because someone is hiding something, okay? Wow, my gosh. There's a lack of strength and confidence here, and I feel that you're trying to be very brave. You're trying to be strong. Find that very deep inner strength you have um, to find out what the secrets are. I feel like both of you have some secrets. Yours are fears, fear of sharing your feelings, just some very deep-rooted fears of things that you're hiding. And it could be to do with your emotions. So take this however it is. But I feel there's definitely this... I don't like this three. There's a third-party situation. Uh, somebody's invested. Maybe it's been exposed. Somebody's, you know, has another connection, someone else. There's supposed to be some joy here. But someone's not... Um, compromising they want to keep this relationship a secret keep it hidden and you have some very deep fears about this Pisces yeah that's the truth someone needs to speak the truth something's been exposed here the truth is that someone doesn't feel comfortable they don't feel safe not accepting this sorry you're not investing I don't see any change in you someone came in too soon so let's see what we have to say here about this truth the shield, yeah, see, you need to defend yourself. Someone feels they need to defend themselves. They need to protect themselves, okay, because they don't feel safe. Like somebody will protect them, look after them. They don't have their best interests at heart because they're trying to hide something. And it's something pretty big where somebody has a bunch of other people and they're, so they're just manipulating, using an emotional situation or the lack of to somehow hide something they don't want exposed in the community. They don't want gossip. They don't want to compromise their secrets. We have, let's see here. Tell me about this transformation. And we have happiness. Yeah, so there's the sun, this happiness. So, there was no transformation. Somebody rejected somebody because they don't see this moving forward. They don't see this situation making them happy. Someone's not expressing themselves. Tell me about the sun on this side. Yeah, so wind chimes, peace and harmony. Yeah, someone doesn't see that, right? They don't see it's not being expressed. There's no peace and harmony because somebody's turning. There could be. There is a soul connection. You you both, neither one of you are moving. Somebody is more emotionally invested than the other, but there is this lovely connection where two people actually do connect. You could be blocking each other. There could be peace and harmony. It's really sad, but somebody's ruined it. Somebody's frustrated because somebody, one of you isn't opening up because they don't feel safe like this is ever going to be solid or reliable. Let's tell me about this Three of Cups. Why is this here? Yeah, doing something risky, taking a chance. See, somebody doesn't want to take a chance. They don't want to risk their secrets coming out. They don't want to compromise their secrets. They have other connections, other people. Somebody's all about their own happiness. They're all about themselves here. And there's something that maybe you didn't see before about this person that's making you feel indecisive. I feel like you're getting some clarity from this, that there, you know this person's hiding something really deep, and it's making you uh, really, really afraid, okay? 
So yeah, doing something risky, taking a chance. And I feel we've got this tiger. Someone needs to look at that Leo energy. Somebody needs to gain the strength and the confidence here. Um, to it, But it's a risk. This is a thing. Someone doesn't want to take a risk. They feel like somebody hasn't tamed the beast within themselves. They're focused too focused on the passion. They're keeping secrets. Other people they're having intimacy with. This is what I'm seeing. So let's go up to this Ten of Cups. Yeah, see the rainbow. The most difficult part of the situation is over. Somebody thought something was over. There was going to be peace. That everything could be put in the past. Somebody was coming in to put some work in. They're going to plant the seed, but the seed's not being watered. There's no water hardly here, okay? There needs to be, right? This is what it needs. Someone needs to express themselves if they want happiness, if they want somebody to make them happy. But it's an equal give and take, right? We have this cooperation, compromise, teamwork. Tell me about the Ten of Pentacles with the Four of Cups. Wreath, sore over loss. Yeah, see, somebody's been rejected because they didn't come in stable. They weren't, didn't make someone feel safe because they didn't express themselves. They're keeping secrets and hiding things, whether it's their emotions, their fears. Someone has a lot of inner work to do when it comes to teamwork, cooperation, compromise. Something just didn't work. It's going to take a lot of work here. So I feel it was all about the timing for a lot of you. Tell me about the Two of Swords and we'll wrap this up. Yoke, yeah. Feeling tied down or frustrated. So things are very stuck. See, there's that frustration. Somebody's just frustrated and kind of fed up with this whole situation. Turning their back, refusing to move. It's anxiety, head games, manipulation. Someone feels they're being manipulated. Maybe it's not exactly what's happened, but they feel that way. There is a need for peace and harmony. They Somebody thought they were going to get that, and it didn't happen. Nothing's moving. Neither one of you are moving. Just it's And it's basically saying, just be still right now. Whoever this person is, let them go within. Let them finish this healing. They came in too soon. They didn't come in... Uh, they, they weren't ready to share their feelings, and that's where all this fear comes in. But it also has to do with the three of stones. Some, somebody, you know, somebody who needs to tame that beast, tame their passions, right? They don't, they're afraid something is going to come out in the open. There'll be gossip, third-party situations here. One more for, tell me about this Eight of Pentacles. There we go. Yeah, so we have the Vulture. Depression, anxiety, worry that something is against you. See, somebody here. We got an energy vampire, you know. We got this Vulture. Somebody who, very anxious energy. Somebody wanted to come forward. They brought some information, wanted to make peace, but they couldn't make up their mind. They There's something they didn't see. So there's this blocked energy. Everything just came to a complete stop. So we have the vulture, yeah, depression, anxiety. Somebody needs to go within and work on themselves. Uh, this seed here is being planted, but it still needs a lot of work. Something didn't work. Somebody was trying to manipulate somebody, and it didn't work here. Their plan didn't work. They didn't put enough work in. They didn't come in with enough of the right information. Someone didn't learn from their... They didn't learn their lessons properly. Let's see what the outcome is. Oh, Pisces, yeah. There we go. Yeah, happiness. You just want to be happy, right? Here you are. You just want to be happy. You just want to go with the flow. So you're kind of riding the wave right now. You got your highs and your lows, okay? But I feel like this could move forward, okay? But what you want to do is you want to make sure that somebody doesn't come in and they just want to make themselves happy at your expense. And I feel like that's what the fear is. Okay. So like I said, flip this if you if you must. Yeah, voyage. <laughs> this card tried to come out a sec ago. And it was sort of sitting on the top. And I kind of pulled it. And I went, oh, I put it back in and out it came. Confirmation. Yeah. Someone's on a long emotional journey here. This is going to take, somebody needs longer. Somebody is going through either some kind of awakening, healing, where they need to, somebody needs to kind of go back to the drawing board and start over. If they want to come back around, they need to go within. They need to go on this voyage. This is this need to rise above. 
Look at that, rising above here, riding the wave, going with the flow. Someone needs to go back to the drawing board and figure out what it is that makes them happy, what they want. All right, if they want to come back around, they need to not manifest. If they want peace and harmony, they need to be honest. They need to express themselves and tell the truth. And that's the way it goes. All right, so I had to pause for a moment. The dog barked. One more message for Pisces. Pisces, there we go. Simplicity, yeah. See, this is what it is. It needs to be simple. Somebody needs to simplify things. They need to just go with the flow. All right, it's time to just, somebody may be thinking I'm just blowing this off, letting it go, but it needs to be simple. Somebody is digging too deep. Someone's like using their head over their heart a little bit too much here. They're not wanting to express themselves. They want to be happy, but they're going about it in the wrong way. So it's sort of, the message I'm getting is just keep it simple. Okay, and I feel like that's what you want. You just want something simple, something easy. You find that this just isn't easy. You're so frustrated with this person because they complicate everything. You're very frustrated with them. So I feel like you're just, don't feel confident with this person. Your intuition's telling you this person just hasn't tamed the beast. They haven't gone within um, because of this vulture up here, you see. This is somebody who kind of likes to, possibly prey on other people they're just looking for that physical connection this is someone here you know it right this person doesn't connect on a you may have a mental connection you may actually be very much mentally connected you get each other um, when you're communicating but because this person manipulates too but then somebody isn't as emotionally connected and that's the problem they're more about the passion so all right i'm going to do one more for pisces Pisces, this is a tough one, but I feel like you're just riding the wave right now. Just kind of go with the flow. I feel like uh, things aren't moving. Just concentrate on yourself and your own happiness because you there is this definite. Someone feels they really need to defend themselves. They feel very, very guarded. They feel afraid. So yeah, someone needs to take the lead here. Uh, there's a need to level up and be a leader. Someone needs to grow up is the way I'm seeing it. Okay. Don't let somebody come in and prey on you because the vulture is a, you know, this is somebody who comes in and, but this is also about doing inner work. It's about picking the bones clean, right? Getting to the truth, going right down to the nitty gritty because there's this depression, anxiety, worry, someone is against you. And that's the thing. Yeah, it's not, it's not a good energy. It could be healed. Somebody just needs to grow up. And they need to be a leader. They need to go within and, and figure out what it is they want, what makes them happy before they approach somebody else. They need to do that inner healing. It's like learning to make yourself happy first before you can make somebody else happy. Okay? But it's also when that vulture's here and someone has that, they just, it's an energy of, I want to come towards you and I want to make myself happy at your expense. And that's why we have the shield. So something is about to be illuminated. Somebody is going very deep within something has been exposed here where one of you has got to go within it's looking for answers within uh, to deal with your fears to deal with the things that you're hiding maybe even from yourself because somebody's not seeing things clearly they're not seeing a way forward so it's a very frustrated energy so i feel like it's just a matter of time where somebody needs to get some clarity and figure out what they want what their intentions are where this is going or the other person is not going to feel safe and it really will not go anywhere. It's like a standoff to do with an emotional situation. Yeah, there's this inner peace. There could be peace here between the two of you. But somebody chooses to be more manipulative and, and not express themselves. Not possibly even tell the truth here. Uh, there's a lack of balance and, and some kind of injustice the way someone is going about things. So take care of yourselves. I hope this works itself out. I will do some bonus readings this week. Uh, hopefully there'll be something positive and some kind of progression. Take care, everyone. Bye for now.